Good day everyone, welcome to my channel. So in this video, I will talk about what is system analysis in design. Before we start, I would like to say thank you so much to all my viewers, silent viewers, and supporters in my channel. Thank you for watching my videos. If you are new with my channel and then you like this video, please hit the like button. Don't forget to share and please support my channel guys if you are new by clicking the subscribe button. So let's begin. What is system analysis in design? System analysis in design is a process used in the development of computer-based information systems to ensure that they met the needs of the users and the organization. The process involves a systematic approach to identify, define, analyze, and document the requirements for the system and then design and implement the system based on those requirements. System analysis in design can be broken down into several stages each of which is important in ensuring the success of the projects. These stages include requirements gathering. This stage involves identifying the needs and requirements of the system stakeholders, including users, management, and technical staff. This can be done through interviews, survey, surveys, observation, and other techniques. The requirements gathered in this stage will form the basis of the system design feasibility study once the requirements have been gathered the feasibility of the project is assessed this involves evaluating whether the project is technically visible financially feasible and whether it aligns with the goals and objectives of the organization system analysis this stage involves analyzing the requirements and identifying the functions and processes that the system needs to perform to meet those requirements. This involves in developing a conceptual model of the system which outlines the relationships between the various components of the system. The de system design Based on the conceptual model developed in the analysis stage, the system design stage involves creating detailed specifications for the system. This includes defining the system architecture, selecting hardware and software components, designing user interfaces, and developing detailed algorithms and data structures. Implementation the implementation stage involves build, uh, building the system based on the specification developed in the design stage. This may involve coding, testing, and debugging the software as well as installing and configuring the hardware. Testing and maintenance. Once the system had been implemented, it needs to be thoroughly tested to ensure that it meets the requirements and functions correctly. Ongoing maintenance and support also required to ensure the system remains up to date and continues to meet the needs of the users and or the, the organization. Overall, system analysis in design is a critical process in the development of computer-based information systems. It ensures that the system meets the needs of the stakeholders technically and financially visible and is designed and implemented to a high standard. By the following a systematic approach, organizations can reduce the risk of project failure and ensure the resulting system provides real value to the organization. Okay guys, so this is the end of my presentation. What is system analysis in design? Thank you so much guys for watching. I hope that you have learned something new in this tutorial video. Don't forget to like, share, and please support my channel guys if you are new by clicking the subscribe button. See you in the next video tutorial guys. This is your friend Jake saying bye bye for now.